flags flying. Let's see, that's about 15. Maybe. Let's see if I can get closer. Alright, I'm gonna go inside and grab some bait. So, uh, I'll be right back. Alright, they don't have any crab, but I did get some mullet. I didn't get many, because I got like three big ones. Cut them in twos. Yeah, so we'll try our luck with uh, some mullet here. Damn, look at those. Go ahead and go on to the dike. I think this looks like a good spot. Let's see here. Like every other spot on this uh, on this dike, I usually want to go down towards the end, but I know it's super packed. But we'll try our luck here. All right, so let's pull out some rods and let's get to fishing. Come on, look at this. This is a classic. An antique, a pin 555 GS. <laughs> this is one of my old surf rides. I haven't thrown this in a decade or more. And of course I got some new stuff here. But uh, we'll set up. So. Yeah, I even made my own leaders back then. I think this is 300 pounds. 300 pound mono, 400 pound swivel. I think that's a 20, 20 odd. That guy was going like 50. So before I start setting up my other, uh, my rod. So this morning, when I checked those uh, three weather apps, they were saying it's what, 15 to 25. One says 10 to 15, another one was 10, 12. I forgot, but it's not that windy. I mean, this is pretty, pretty common here in the Galveston area. I mean, it feels really good just to be out here. I mean, just, just, just take a look at this. I mean, this is, oh, we got a dolphin over there, which is a bad sign or a good sign. You don't know. There's just so much life out here, out in the ocean, out, out in salt water. You know, you got birds everywhere. It's just a great place to be. Hopefully, uh, hopefully that rod right there just bows down and rips some drag, and we'll pull up a big black drum or a bull red. That'll be a that'll be a surprise, right? I haven't done I haven't done this type of fishing in so long, but yeah, it's gonna be a good day. I hope. <laughs> it's 
got to be fish. <laughs> wow, that's a big whiting. Ah, first whiting. I heard these are pretty good to eat. First fish. I think we're gonna eat this whiting. So, pat of drying, blackened seasoning, and cayenne pepper. So, let's do that. I think that's a little too much. Maybe one side? Yeah, just do one side. And a little bit more. There you go. Let's get a hot pan, some butter, and let's see how these taste like. Smells good. Hmm. Not bad. Very mild taste. That is firm, like, speckled trout. But it's really good. I made a mistake for the past 20 plus years of using this as bait rather than table fare. So if I catch a whiting again, we're gonna be cooking it. Good stuff.